Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. Today we have a crazy day planned. This is June, so this is a crazy month, okay? And then after this is 4th of July and a bunch of other things that I have planned. And then it's August, another birthday, and then it's, um, what's after August? I don't know, but then a bunch of holidays start coming. So like, this is like the, the crazy part of the year. I'm gonna go give a little haircut. I don't know if I've mentioned that already, probably not. I'm like scrambling all over the place, but this is like his fifth or sixth haircut, like ever in his life. And I'm just like, <laughs> he's growing up, you know? Anyways, this is gonna be Oliver's second haircut. Um, He's also gonna get one, cause we need them birthday ready, but I don't want him to have like such a short haircut, cause I don't want them to cut it too short, but they always do. So I don't want it to be super short and fresh for his birthday. So we're doing it like two weeks in advance. That way it should like grow in just fine and he'll look good. He won't look like a shaved little sheep or something. So I don't know. I'm also gonna take him to Miami for the weekend. I'm probably gonna be like, this vlog is probably gonna be like a Miami weekend, but whatever. So I also need to pack his bag. So yeah, I have a lot to do. The reason why we're, we're leaving him with my mom for this weekend is because I wanna do a lot of things for his party. So with him being gone and added here, I feel like it'll actually give me some time, which is perfect because I could use that. And I would stay with Oliver because Oliver doesn't do as much as him. Everything is kind of crazy right now, but I move stuff around. I still need to find a curtain. I just, I get so overwhelmed when I start looking, but this is kind of like how our living room is looking now. Don't mind him. I just, I feel like I needed like a fresh start to things and that, something new in my living room, like that kind of helped me out a lot. Okay, so we got dressed, we got out of the house. We're right here in the parking lot for the haircut place. We're finally here and Oliver fell asleep. So, that's amazing. Wow, where are you? <laughs> Hi! Oh, you... You're doing so good. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, so I just put gas. The kids did amazing, amazing over there at, at the salon. They they really did. They did a great job. Now we are gonna go to my mom's. I'm just putting the address. Actually, I think I'm gonna grab like McDonald's or something because they haven't eaten lunch yet and it's lunch time. We're here. We just got to my mom's house. One eternity later. I just love like how every time I put the camera on, there's just like food and snacks all over. <laughs> it looks good. It looks thick. Hi, good morning. So we're in Dollar Tree right now. We're literally parked outside. Yesterday we couldn't finish the pinata, but we did do a lot. Okay, so we built the base around it. We started the paper mache on it. So we're getting things done. Now I'm here for a lot of materials. I actually made a huge list of stuff I need to buy. Some of the things are for the piñata that I didn't think I was going to need until. And yeah, so I only have one child with me, so this shouldn't be that hard. Leo has been amazing with my mom the whole night. He was pretty, pretty good. My plan for today is to come here, then go back home, finish everything I have to finish, stay up again if I need to, and then do it again the next day. Because there's a lot, you guys. There's a lot I want to do. Hey guys, so we're back home. Dollar Tree was chaotic. Oliver did not want to stay still. I thought life was easier with one baby, but honestly, it's just the terrible twos are terrible. So who would have thought? We're going to start doing the other stuff um, that we're missing for the party. I want to decorate the goodie bags. So I got these. They come in a pack of two. And this is what I want to try to make or something like it. I just want to put the Mickey heads. I want to put the name 
for which kid it belongs to so that way there's like no arguments and like nobody stole my stuff or he stole my stuff no he stole my things i also got this white board and i got a bunch of other stuff like goodies i already opened it i can't help myself they're so good and i kind of want to put his name on it with a bunch of cups just kind of leading up to his birthday and i want to put like a bunch of little goodies like for example this night lights that he's been needing one so i just want to like put it up there kind of like an advent calendar but for his birthday i thought that was kind of cute so we're also going to do that and i don't know how much i'm going to be able to actually do this weekend without him that's why we left him at my mom's so i can kind of get like a head start on things but there's just so much that i want to do for his birthday so this is how it's looking we left this overnight and that was a bad idea i'm gonna have to start making a new one because look at this what is that but this is literally just flour salt and water that's that's all it is that's paper mache guys and then it's leading up to this we still have to do the other side it's a little damp so let me start on the goodie bags because that one is a big deal to me yesterday we stayed up pretty late too but it wasn't as late as the first day so we did the other half of the piñata one thing i did not know is that we had to wait like two days or so to let it dry we have been trying to leave the fan on all night with it but still it's just it's getting there it's not fully dry but it's it's pretty hard already um obviously we're gonna leave it a little more time but we're gonna finish it off but we have majority of the of the piñata already completed all we're missing is the size but this part is already hard and this other side of it is already hard and honestly i think it's coming out so much better than if we would have bought it like yeah we also finished the goodie bags which is amazing because i really wanted to get them done i thought it looked a little plain but i don't know i posted it on instagram and you guys told me that it was fine like that so we're just gonna leave it because we're in this together so this is how it looks i thought it was so cute i got my inspo from pinterest they are the best and now we're cutting some stuff for the balloons because i want to do a balloon okay this is what it looks like this is the balloon right now like yeah because oliver does not let it go but anyways yeah so we're gonna finish up the a couple more designs for the balloons and then I want to do the board for him like the week before his birthday. I wanted to get like little treats. This is what we have so far. So this is gonna be the front, and then this is gonna be the back. All right, all right. These are the sides. Pretty nice, pretty nice. So we finished it. And this is how the piñata looks. Oh my god, so cute. 
So this was the whiteboard I got from Dollar Tree and we turned it into a birthday countdown board and it came out way too good. I am obsessed with it. I can't wait for him to open it each day and find a little treat. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed and tell me which one you like most.